Hi guys, welcome back to the fourth video in my travel week series. Today I have two on-trend DIY accessories for you to try that are both simple and affordable and are perfect to rock this summer season. First up is the Instagram slogan hat. So you will need a big floppy beach hat. I got this one from Primark for only three pounds. Some black string sequins, scissors, fabric glue, and a marker. First off you're going to decide on your slogan you want to place on your hat and then you're going to roughly draw this out onto a separate piece of paper first just so you can see where it's going to go. Once you're happy with how your design looks you can begin to draw this onto the hat with your marker. Next, start fabric gluing the letters so you can stick your sequins on in one go for each word. Then you can start gluing your sequins on. Now don't worry if you can't use your whole string of sequins in one go, as some of the letters may need the sequins to be cut anyway, and then restarted to make the words look joined all together. For the dot on the letter I, all I did was just cut a small string of sequins and join them together to form a circle. Once you finish your slogan, allow this to dry and then you're good to go rocking your slogan hat just like Beyonce but at a fraction of the price. Lastly, onto the pom-pom sandals. So you will need a pair of lace-up tan sandals, a selection of different size pom-poms, a glue gun, some coloured embroidery thread, scissors and some gold beads. These Instagram worthy pom pom sandals are really so simple to make. All you need to do is sporadically place your different size coloured pom poms up the sandals. Then for the tassel parts I took a large amount of embroidery thread that I looped around my fingers. Then taking a second piece of thread, place this on top of the bunch thread in the middle and fold the main threads over this second piece. Once you've done this tie a few knots at the top to secure this. Next take a third piece of thread and wrap this around the top of the tassel several times and tie again to secure. Lastly, you're going to cut the main bunch thread at the bottom to create your tassel and I made three of these in pink and orange for each sandal. I also found when securing my pom-poms and tassels that it helped to try the sandals on so you could see where it was best to place them all. Lastly, to finish the ends of the tie parts, I just fed in a few gold beads and attached a small pom-pom to each at the end. Once completed and dry, they should look something like this and you're ready to wear the most wanted sandals of the season without breaking the bank. 
so guys thank you so much for watching and give this video a thumbs up if you got inspired to diy this season if you do make these don't forget to tag me in any of my social media so i can see your recreations also don't forget to subscribe and if you missed my last two previous videos you can go ahead and click on the picture links and that will take you to that video have a wonderful rest of the day or evening guys and i will see you in my next video. Take care. Bye.